Hey there. So this video is a business update on my site projects. As you can see on my note here, this is where we are right now. So if you don't know, I have two projects. I have Focus Desk and WhisperMemos.com. So I'll first show you Focus Desk. This is a to-do app that I've been working on for like a year now, and I love it. I use it every day. It's my way to get my life organized, and I have quite a few users on this. Whisper Memos, on the other hand, is a weekend project that I did recently when I got really excited about the new Whisper technology. It's just a really accurate transcription service where I can record a voice memo and it sends me an email with it. A big part of it is sending the email. It's really cool to just dictate something and receive it uh, as a reminder or maybe a book note, that sort of thing. So this one is was a lot of fun to work on and I use this every day too. So these two projects are currently making um, an MRR of 38 euros or dollars. It's all the same these days. So there has been no change in the past week and uh, for the, like until the next week, I don't know if there will be any change because I'm not heavily pushing any marketing right now. I know I should, and I will get to it. Right now, I'm working on an experiment. So I'm building a referral system inside Whisper Memos. Uh, you can see see it here in my simulator. When you when you're trying to subscribe, you'll first see your subscription options, and if you don't like those you'll see a refer a friend button. When you click that, it'll give you a link that you can copy into clipboard. And when you open that, when your friend opens that, they will be redirected to the app store. And if they sign up, um, you'll get 20 free memos on your account. So it's a great way for someone who is not quite sold on getting the app, getting the subscription, but would like to continue using it for free. And it's my first time doing a referral program like that. I just really wanted to try if it'll work at all. So this is my experiment. And uh, my goal for this week is to actually finish the implementation and get it into in the App Store because I haven't yet. And then um, so Whisper Memos has received uh, quite a bit of traffic from Hacker News, but not much since. So if we look at this, hmm, Google, interesting. <laughs> what were they? I don't know. Never mind. Somebody from India Googled it. That's great. Uh, anyway, if you look at weeks analytics or more like month, there was a huge spike on the Hacker News post. I actually added analytics a little late, so I think there's been more like 2K visitors. And um, then it just kind of went down to zero. So I'm looking for new ways to get uh, traffic on this uh, on this project. Part of it is that I quickly put together my personal blog here where I'm posting mostly technical stuff and sometimes little philosophy about being focused because that's something I enjoy thinking about and reading about. So just like book excerpts, things like that. And of course, some technical stuff This like this. Um, so other developers are likely to share this stuff uh, eventually running traffic to my website. That is good. So I'll try to block uh, as much as I can, although it's not my favorite activity. And um, really, I'm just going to be looking uh, at like Reddit and some other websites like Indie Hackers, some places where I could share this project and get a little feedback. Um, maybe I'll make 10k a day, like peer levels one day. Um, anyway, um, let's see here. Um, so, so this was last week and this is this week. Um, basically, mm, I have a few more active users who are using Whisper Memos, but they didn't become a paid customer yet. So this MRR could be higher next week and, or they could refer somebody else, which would be great outcome too. Okay, so this is my week 44 of this year, and I'll try to um, I'll try to do an update again in a week. See ya.